Alright, I wanted to do a video on this everyday carry I made with the alligator sheath. And, uh, got my name stamped in the sheath. But I made this for somebody, a family member, and uh, I'm going to give it to them this evening or tomorrow. I might, you know, go live with it on Facebook and uh, gift it to them, show them what I made for them. Get it out of the sheath here, but this is African babinga wood. I worked for a guy trucking that trucked the lumber, the babinga that was harvested in Africa and sent to Germany, and he hauled the wood for the guy. And the guy gave him some of the babinga, and I made a couple tomahawks with the babinga. And I'm hope I'm getting that right. Um, but anyway, it's from Africa, and it was harvested there hand selected and then uh, dried and cut in Germany. But here is woolly mammoth ivory. And yes, you can own ivory if it's woolly mammoth. So uh, I got that at the gun show quite a few years ago and I've hung on to it to make a special knife. So <clears throat> this is going to somebody that means a lot to me and, and uh, I hope he enjoys it. But this is Chainsaw Damascus and 1095. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, this thing is razor sharp. Um, I was trying to get a good video. Oh, maybe I can do this. I don't know how well this will work. But it's kind of dry, but I can find Here we go. Yeah, that thing is sharp. Shave the hair right off my arm, no problem. Uh, I could probably shave my face, I'm sure, with this. But, beautiful little blade. Um, like I said, I got a alligator sheath with it. And, uh, got my name stamped in there. The only thing I'm disappointed about is when I riveted that, it's kind of offset, but I'm not going to worry about it too much. But there we go. Um, there it is. And I hope he enjoys it because uh, I really enjoyed making it. And it's a cool piece. And I, I know he'll enjoy it. But uh, this one is Mammoth Ivory. I use the larger pieces. For my uh, for my uh, handle, I don't know how well this is coming. It's hard to tell out here, but uh, same thing, chainsaw of Damascus, and it needs a little finished up on the edge, so it will be razor sharp. Also, I'm trying to get the right light here. But I have some uh, rattlesnake. I'm going to make a rattlesnake sheath for this one. And it should look pretty badass when I'm done. I'm excited to do the rattlesnake sheath. I've been wanting to do it for a long time. And it come from a buddy of mine. So I've got to make his Damascus blade. Uh, he wants a large bowie. So I'm going to be making a bowie for him with a Damascus pattern and uh, the rattlesnake sheath. But there they are. There's the two mammoth ivories together, and uh, I hope you guys like it, and I'm out. Thank you.